Hey guys, welcome back. I am Selena from digital2design.com. In this video, I will show you how to make a 3D Instagram posts using Canva Pro. Okay, let's get started. For this design, I am going to use Canva on my PC. Open canva.com. Here we need to choose Instagram posts. Now go to elements. Scroll down, we are going to select grid. And adjust the height of this grid. Now let's duplicate this frame. Ok, now we have the basis of the layout. We would like to add the buttons. Again go to elements. Search for the heart. Let's change the color to black. Then adjust its position. Now I'm going to add a guide actually. So show rulers and show guides. Because this is going to help me later on to create the next section of this layout. Ok, so here we have a heart button. Then let's try to find the comment button. Let me flip it horizontally. So it looks more like the actual button on Instagram. Let's position it next to the heart. Now let's add the paper plane. Make slightly tilt. Now I just need to add the icon that goes on the right which is the save icon. Let me try to find an icon in graphics. Let's add a text box to replicate the like counter. So pressing T to bring a text box. For this text box, I'm going to use a font called Aileron Regular. I think this is close enough to the font that we see on Instagram. Let's add a big like counter and then likes. Ok, now let's position this text box around here. And let's start creating the next section. Now we are going to add the space that we see in between the two different posts. So press R, and then create this little section over. Here we can change the color to gray. Now I'm going to add two lines so one above this rectangle gonna make it very thin. Ok. Now we are going to recreate the section that we see on top of this post. So that will be the profile picture and the name. So let's add a circular frame. Go to elements. Search for gradient. We have a gradient that I think it's going to look very close to what we see on Instagram. So let me place it inside the frame. And now let's adjust the size. We are going to add our photo. So this will be the profile picture right. So let's go to uploads if you have your photo ready. Adjust the size of your frames. Now add profile name after profile picture. If you want a location you can also add it. In the right corner, add three dots. Ok, let's start creating 3D Instagram posts. Ok, I am going to make 3D posts for farm to home dairy products. First, we need to add photos for this grid. Let's go to elements. Type, cow farms. Switch to photos. 
choose whatever you want if you're not satisfied with the canvas stock images no worries you can open new tab visit freepick.com here you can find any images you want i want images related to dairy farms choose whatever you want i am going to choose this one click on download kindly don't forget to give attributes to freepick.com if you want more free stock images like this click here to watch this video okay now we need to upload this photo to canva let's go back to canva click on upload select the downloaded photo from your computer now place the photo over the grid and adjust its position for this grid i want kitchen photos go to elements search for the kitchen choose the photo you want i am going to choose this one now adjust its position okay now we gonna make 3d visualization again go to elements search for milk pour this gonna be perfect for my design place this element over this first grid if you want you can rotate its position just now leave as it is now we need glass and some pour effects again go to elements search for glass of milk now choose the perfect one place it over a second grid we need a milk pouring effect go back to elements search for the milk pour effect this gonna be perfect for me place it upon the position you need okay now let's make a shadow for this element to make it even more realistic you can also adjust the customization of these shadows okay finally our 3d design is completed this is how you can do any 3d designs using canva if you have canva pro account you can be made this design more effective click here to get canva pro account i hope you like this video don't forget to subscribe to digital to design finally thank you for watching